Hey guys, welcome back to some more Metro 2033. This actually surprisingly didn't take me as long as I thought it would, and now I'm getting shot at. Um, speak of the devil. Alright, I need to... Put on my night vision. Or not. Let's see if we can find him. Oh, okay. He's definitely not happy with me. Hey, you want to go on a little exploration trip? Yeah, of course you guys do. You guys don't want to go out there. Alright, let's just uh, hop down. Whoa, okay. This is actually not the way we're supposed to go, uh, technically. But um, it's still kind of an interesting place to be in. Like it's a, it's a little side passage. With uh, an automatic shotgun. And that's pretty much it. I already have one of those. So I got like 95 ammo with this. And with this one I got 113. So I still have a fair bit of ammo for this weapon. Uh, but I think I got everything that was there. Plus it gave me karma. Alright, let's go back into night vision. Now, I really want to cut across to the other side, but that guy is constantly there. I can't actually tell where he, I can't tell where he is. He keeps getting shot up. The problem is that there's this there's this light here, and even though like I'm technically blocking it with that, uh, I'm still dot getting hit by it, but I can run all the way over here. Okay, let's take out more of that stuff so I get... I think we get... Nope, no, nope, we didn't get him. I... Where did they come from, though? I thought I had that side. I'm, I'm hearing someone screaming, too, so that's not a good sign. Let's try and get to a higher position. This guy has a light on his thing. Yeah, yeah literally, he has a light. And it's, it's causing me a problem because it didn't turn off. And I'm starting to run out of battery. Oh, wait. Damn it. Got him. I think we're done now. They even have, like, grenades and stuff. Anyways, I really like the night vision mechanic in this. Because it's, like, the one kind of futuristic thing that you wouldn't think to find here. Uh, but it's here. Okay, so up that way is the front lines. That's uh, where the Nazi um, line is. And that's an awful idea to actually go that way, because uh, then they'll know I'm here and all that kind of jazz. Uh, so, you know, you I'm pretty sure you could do it if you were a total baller. Um, I'm sure I could too, but I, I, did, I did pick out things that were meant more for stealth. Uh, so that's why you're going to actually probably see me go the stealthy way. We've, we've killed pretty much everybody on the front lines here, though. There's like these pipes and holes everywhere. Oh my god. I can't even begin to tell you how horrible it was for me to to go through some of this stuff. Alright, well we have uh We have some parkouring to do. Because that's that's what Metro is known for. It's it's a parkour game. Uh debating if I should just take this off and then just use this. Yeah, this is probably easier. Alright. You guys ready for a leap of faith? Yeah. Oh. Got that? I don't have that much faith. We're gonna get plenty of night vision as it is. The one thing that's kind of cool, apparently, about the night vision that is it makes you more visible. Because uh, people can hear the night vision goggles. I think I have to jump over there. This is the path he laid out? Like, seriously? This is not realistic of a path. Let's go this way. I really like this uh, this SVS weapon, though. Uh, it's something that you're going to see me keep until the end. There's, there's really no reason for me not to keep it. Uh, I kind of want to go on here. Shit. 
They stepped in glass. There's some ammunition over there. Uh, and you can also go to the bottom. And I think there's a back way? Uh, I'm debating if I should take that. Um, it's probably a good idea if I do, actually. So let me go back down there. There's a couple of traps there. I think I can't handle, though. I'm trying to think of just the stealthiest ways. Alright. Where are we going? We're going over here. Yep. This looks pretty, uh, smoggy, so... So, right now we're gonna be looking for traps, because that, that's actually what one of the conversations was earlier between some of the soldiers, was they were complaining about the use of tra the traps, I think. Um, also, I have played this part before, so I'm trying to be a little cautious. Yeah, we need the night vision. Uh, one sec. Let's have a look around. I know that I, I think there's nothing here. I actually haven't really taken a good deal of time to explore this area anyways. So it's kind of kind of cool just being like this is at the bottom. It's like very irradiated. So like they have weapons that fell down here. I wonder if you can get in back into the um, uh, to the, the reds area actually. Actually, I don't really know why I'm not using this. So I feel like I'm missing I'm missing stuff if I don't actually go explore around here for a little bit. I can even create light, even like like double the light. Alright, well, we knew there wasn't any traps directly here, so. And watch me fall into it. It's gonna happen. And I just wanna check out like rubble and stuff because there's probably something there. Yeah, look at that. Like, there's a staircase here? There has to be something. Oh, what's at the top of these stairs? No, it's not even a staircase. Wait, I really like the immersion, and I'm really into um, this ranger mode, if you get a chance to ever play it on ranger mode. I don't know why people, like, I, I've had people, heard people say that they've had difficulty with this, and I'm just like, how? It's not that difficult, but... Hey, wait, there's a skeleton here. That's pretty much it. Well, I guess that's it. There is, really isn't anything here. There's like a helmet here. Like it, it looks like there would be something here that's a loot, but uh, I don't actually see anything. Like, I'm trying to turn off the light because it actually uh, will show me much easier actually if there is items here. But uh, alas, there is nothing. Unless I'm completely fucking blind. The more probable case. Alright, well, let's go. Uh, yeah, we're gonna start running into the traps very, quite soon. Those, those Nazis are really dickish about their traps. But yeah, so they can hear, like, the night vision and stuff, and it's just like, Oh, here we go. What did I say? Okay, we, we disarmed it. The really the really interesting thing is how this kind of mimics what uh, happened in like Russia, like how they would have the thing going like, well, we'll give you warm meals and you know, all you have to do is give up and surrender. Like really demoralized Russian sort of a thing. It's interesting. I like how it kind of imitates that. It's, it's cool. But it kind of makes me wonder where all like the technology is, because you know, this is Metro 2033. Like, you know, they don't have many computers or laptops or anything like that. Uh, there's another one right here. No, not this one. Can you please disarm this? Thank you. Yeah, there's another one like right here. I can't even take the green. I don't even really know why I'm bothering. I, d I don't like traps. The completionist in me is like, you have to do this. Oh, like even more. I'm really prickish about this. 
And they're all grenade traps anyways. Okay, well I think we're done in this area. I'm just, I'm, I'm a little overly cautious because I always run into something. Let's see what's at the end of the tunnel. Apparently nothing. But there is a nice little ladder here. Oh, the guy even put like more light and more uh, more signs over here. What a nice guy, except he's dead. <laughs> there are two guys there. No, just one. Fuck. Oh, there was there's another one. Shit. Okay, we got him. Guess we're just gonna wait for him. I'm sure they'll be coming to me. I... I totally didn't see the other guy here. That was my bad. Stealth. But you know, as I said, it, there's still there's still a little bit of stealth to it. Like I mean, it's you can you can play very hidden. Like I like stabbing things. Oh right, there's a lot of guys here. Oh, it's gonna suck. I, uh, yeah, so now we have the entire, um, uh, Nazi army completely aware of the fact I'm here. Oh god. Okay, they know I'm here. So let's go, uh, down here for a sec. So this is now the combat stealth. So now you don't get to see me, uh... Now let's go and put on night vision. See, I'm, I'm constantly in the green here. We're gonna just wait here for a second. I'm look at look at this. I'm completely in the dark. I kind of like this weapon. Maybe I should use my health thing. This bitch has killed one of us. What the fuck? I kind of kind of just went flying. What the fuck just killed me? The fuck? God, the most awesome of deaths. Alright. I, I sometimes don't understand this game. Like, I've been dying in the weirdest of places, basically. Alright. Um... It looks like whenever that they're pushed around, there's either some sort of explosive fuel here or something along those lines. All right, let me see what we got. So I'm taking out the lights. So now I'm hopefully completely invisible. Fuck. Yeah, that's... That's the reason I was like moving down here, it's every time. They seem to know I'm here. Alright, I'm gonna try a little page out their book. Oh, the grenade would naturally cause light to appear near me. You know, since they completely know I'm here, actually, don't. No, what? I thought I had a. One with a scope. No, I have one with a stock, that's right. I didn't, I didn't buy the scoped one. 
Okay, anywhere I can just run to. Okay, I see a guy right there. Are they dead? Oh, no, there's one right there. Doesn't really take that much ammo. Okay, I, I missed one. Sue me. I want to get in here. How do I get back in? There we go. Back into the cover of uh, wherever the fuck I am. Oh, wait. Damn it. Someone was shooting at me. Fuck. This kid needs to stop killing, like, shooting at me. I'm gonna try and revolver and maybe when it passes by. They don't even seem to really care that I was shooting at them. Let me get your driver. That'll be an amazing shot. What the fuck? They don't even have a driver. What the hell? What the hell is guiding that thing? So who's the asshole who is shooting at me? Uh, someone over there. I think he's up there. Okay, I should perhaps uh, stop doing that. It's really difficult for me to see as well, believe me. It's not doing a hell of a lot of damage either. Sniper tactics. Did I get him? Uh, I think I did. No, this place is oddly quiet now. It's a big improvement. Yet I still hear bullets everywhere. But that's probably just ambience. So it's a it's a tie. And what what does this say about war? Nobody wins. So this is this was their lines and uh Soldiers of the Red Army who the hell's talking? short of ammo and provisions, and your leaders have abandoned you. The oppressive communist government has stripped you of your rights, and now they're using you to protect their regime. Your struggle is useless and your deaths are in vain. Only victory will reunite you with your families for a better future. Join the Army of the Reich. A warm welcome and ample food awaits you there. Soldiers of the Red Army, commanders, make haste. The stations freed by our forces are already addressing problems of food and shelter. So this is the front line here, as a tank here. There's literally nothing else here. I've always, I've always wanted to see what's like in the exact middle here. This is like literally no man's land. The light was annoying me. All right. Yeah, look. Now we can actually see shit. Although that won't be for very long. I think we're in good shape now. I even took out the guys in the in the trolley. Like I didn't actually do that the last time, and that was actually kind of fun to do. Like you could do this, as I said, 100% stealth if you really want to. Uh, that ain't my thing. I kind of like doing this. Wonder if they're gonna notice if that the the guy weirdly they're not weirdly not there. Uh, so this is a regular rifle. All right. Start doing some uh, strategic uh, uh Oh, whoa, whoa. Getting back. I may have overdone that. And I, I was I was actually hoping to, to kind of stealth through the, the whole thing. Well the, at least the rest of it. You can argue why did I even bother taking the stealth suit? Because you could probably stealth it as much as I did without it, but you know, 
It didn't exactly go according to plan, okay. Who the hell is shooting me there? Oh, he is. Got him. Can't really see. There's another guy there. All he had was a shotgun. Wonder if they're gonna know I'm coming now. Yeah, there was um Whoa. We've got casualties. Oh, it's this guy. This bitch has killed one of us. There there's supposed to be a Russian guy that you can you can free here. But uh I guess I didn't do it. That this is really not gonna help me at this point. I can I, I can now you just use this thing right here to to snipe people out. At this point, stealth isn't really gonna help. Oh. And they don't even, like, even though I'm going loud, it doesn't really matter. I, I guess I didn't kill this guy. Oh, I did kill him. That's unfortunate that I couldn't save the Russian soldier. Instead, I just did a whole bunch of bloodshed. Oh well. Wait, what? Thank you, comrade. I heard there was a ranger in the vicinity. Good work. I won't ask you about your mission here. We'll regroup and fall back. I'm oh. honored to meet you. And thanks again. Okay, I thought they would have just ex executed them. Apparently, the minute they uh, were alerted by me, they didn't really matter. I I can't say I was expecting that at all. Well, that was uh, interesting. I don't think there's much else here. Um, yeah, so that, that was the... <laughs> I was talking about. I thought they would have just executed them. There's also you can get good karma just for like not killing anybody as well. What the hell's up here? I'm kinda wondering what's up here. Let's go up here first. There's probably some caches here that I, I probably missed. Somewhere. Okay, let's go and uh let me just uh, get this uh flashlight thing going. That was even the point of this thing. Oh, I can I can go on top of that ladder. Kind of just neat just to look at uh, all these. Uh, I mean, they they put a lot of work into this, like just alternating paths and stuff. It's weird because this is like I've, uh, you know, I've played like games like Splinter Cell, and this is a much better stealth game than that one is. Even though you can play this one kind of like by going loud, sort of a thing. Um, I'm wondering if I should just... Oh, no. Okay. Uh-oh. Okay. I, I'm trying to get over there. I think I have to... Oh, wait. There's another... There's a, whoops. Okay, I'm down. Okay. Fucking yes. And hop over. And there's absolutely nothing here. Why was... It? I literally spent fucking forever on this, and I probably should have just looked over here and saw that there was nothing. Fuck. It's such a good place for like a secret or something. Well, I'm kind of tired of dying here, so I'm gonna try and find a safe fall. Oh, fuck it. Let's just try it. I've done this like 30 times already. Dying fucking on 31st is not really gonna make a difference. I've literally spent half an hour here trying to get up there, and it was all for naught, so. What is even the point of being up there? I guess it's just like a stealth place. Like, it's teasing me because it's like a hard platforming thing, so I thought, that, I thought there'd be a reward. Apparently not. Well, I'm deeply saddened. Oh well. Well, uh... Let's wrap it up here. 
Because every time I fucking died, I had to go back way back to another checkpoint. So I have to kill all those guys again every single time. It was annoying. That was in here. This place is oddly familiar. And no more karma for that. Apparently, I can only play so many musical instruments and get karma for it. Well, I don't see much else here. Huh, okay. Well, it's a shame. Nothing else. Let's move on.